Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, so today I'm doing a different style um, where I'm just showing you the eye look in the beginning and then you can decide if you want to watch it um, after. But this is the eye look that I'm doing today. It's Rasta kind of themed because I'm really into like reggae music and I'm trying these new contacts today and when I saw them I was like okay I have to do some sort of look that's going to complement these contacts and then I just ended up doing this. So, yeah, if you guys want to learn how to do this eye look, then just keep watching. Um, also, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you like today's video. Or if you see my face right now and you're like, hmm, maybe I'll like this girl. Just don't forget to comment and subscribe. And yeah, and turn the notification bell too, because that's important. Anyways, on to today's video. Let's go. Okay, so to get this eye look, today I'm going to be using the Morphe X James Charles palette. I'm also going to be using the Tardius Pro Remix palette. So I'm going to take my Morphe M513 brush and I'm going to go into this kind of like light red shade. I need to learn my colors because I'm not that good at it. But I'm going to go into that shade. Oh, my eyelids are already primed. I used my NARS concealer to prime my eyelids. Um, and I'm going to take that red shade and just put it in my crease. Now I'm going to go into this more bright red right there and I'm going to be packing that onto my lid um, using this packing brush. I'm really not sure where I got it from because it's, it, it erased over time. But it's just a typical really dense packing brush. So I'm just going to take that and pack it here. Just beneath that other color we had put down okay okay and then I'm gonna go back in with my m513 and just blend in the corners or the edges of the eyeshadows Now I'm going to take my concealer, I'm going to cut my crease using the 510, the two, um, 210 from Morphe. I'm just leaving it kind of curved like that. Then I'm going to take my Luxie 239 Precision Shader Brush and I'm going to go into the white shade in the palette. I'm just going to try to pack it as much as I can. And I'm going to take my number 9 brush from BH Cosmetics. I'm going to go back into the brighter red and just like stamp the edges here so it'll be a little more clean. Okay. 
Okay. Now I'm gonna take a white eyeliner. This one is from Stila Cosmetics. Um, it's a stay all day waterproof liquid eyeliner in the shade Snow. And I'm just gonna put a quick liner Got a little messy, but no worries. Okay. This is just so um, I have a base for the yellow liner. I'm just going to take this angled brush. This is from Wet n Wild. And I'm going to go into this color right here. I'm going to start here on the tip. doesn't really matter where you start, but that's what I'm doing. And then with the same brush, I'm going to go into the Tardiest Pro Remix palette. I'm going to go into the color Outside the Lines. Hold on. I'm going to go into Outside the Lines. As you can probably tell, I don't have any foundation or concealer on, so I'm going to put on some concealer. I'm just going to blend this in with my finger. Next, I'm going to go into this lime green shade, and then I'm going to go into this darker green shade. I'm using a smudge brush from IT Brushes. Yeah, it's called the Luminous Smudger. Okay, and then I'm going in with the darker color. It's a little closer to the lash line. I almost forgot, I'm gonna take my NYX Jumbo um, eye pencil in the shade Milk. I'm going to put it on my waterline. And now I'm going to go back in and put it the eyeshadow like on top. Try not to touch my eye. And then I'm taking I'm taking the green from the Tardius Pro palette and I'm going to put that underneath there as well. And a little more green over here. Okay. I'm going to be taking this body liner liquid clip and uh, this <laughs> next I'm going to be taking this liquid crystal body liner from NYX. It's like a golden color. What's the name? I don't know the name. But I'm going to be tracing my lid and then the top of my yellow liner with this. That one came out a little bit messier. I'm just gonna take another angled brush and try to clean that up. Okay. Yep, that's working. Let me do this one too.
the last step, I'm going to put on these premium lashes from Morphe. The style is called Bombshell. I already trimmed them a little bit. I cut off um, about two small pieces from the front of the lashes. I'm going to use Duo Glue. And wait about 30 seconds for it to dry down. Oh my god, I, I forgot to put on mascara beforehand. Ooh. Oh my god, I actually I want to put these down with it while they have um, glue on them, so I'm just gonna try to like hold it while I put on my mascara. I'm using the Benefit Roller Lash. Why am I doing this with my left hand? I don't know. And the final step for the look, I'm just going to put in a yellow highlighter. I'm using the Naked Cosmetics Holographic Highlighter Collection Palette. I'm using this yellow shade right here. I'm going to put that on with my E36 brush from Morphe. Duh. I'm just put it on my inner corner and a little bit on the brow bone. Right. And now I'm just going to put on the rest of my face on oh, off camera and then I will be right back. Okay guys, so this is the finished look. I hope you guys enjoyed this short video today. Let me know in the comments what else you'd like to see. And yeah, if you do any recreations, make sure to tag me on it on Instagram. It's Monica with two A's at the end and then Joy with two Y's. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye!